back. Uh, sorry for the fact that uh, last time. Yes, okay. What I want to say is, uh, last time I had to cut the video a little bit earlier than I expected. I usually try to make those uh, videos around an hour long, but you know, sometimes you just don't have influence over things that happen and require your attention. Uh, by the way, uh, I'm Gabriel, for those of you who don't know. I usually tend to introduce myself, always, because uh, you never know. Uh, so we found out that Lord Darnis, Nalia's father, is dead. My inventory is basically full. And basically everything considered, uh, we still need shall to be. take things from here, which as you could quite see, it's not that good. Well, yes, what else is here? Done. Feeble mind. Two, 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 two. And, uh, something happens there, whatever. Ah, we have some nice amount of loot from here and well this is basically problematic um, items and what equipment is are usually kind of boring here what I left here ah this I don't think we need those it's only four uh, now let me see one more thing before we leave this place my, I will do my best where are... I want to see how where these guys are. The Umber Hulks. I'm out of sight of others. It might be... Oh, okay, they are here. I would have loved to... I'd love to kill them. Uh, but you know... What do you require? It's not really that big of a deal. Yes. These guys aren't that big of a problem, so let's leave this place then. You must get and see what Nalia and others Very have well. to say. Leave the golem. Rather, let's yes. see where the golem is. Because I would like to. I'm out I have to remember that I have done. to kill him. Because it's a bunch of. I'm out of will happen. Nope. That was not what I was hoping to do. No, we need a good ranged weapon to, to kill him. What is my task? Okay. Moving out, we have to go outside. Which yeah, uh, we'll go through the lower level. Basically, I what you I came here for, I already have. That's of course my flail of ages. As you ask. You must gather your party before what? venturing forth. You Get out. Friends. And now let's see. Will I get a second stronghold? It shall be. I'd love to. Let's find Nalia. Of course, she is outside. Standing right in the place where we left her. Somewhere around those parts, this palisade, whatever. Cool. Let's see what these two have to say before I actually speak with Nalia. So, you did manage to stumble your way into victory. Expect no reward beyond what you've undoubtedly stolen from my home. Oh, true enough. I looted the place. And the sooner you're away, the better. You. You have my sincere thanks for all you have done. The Lady Nalia shall reward you suitably. It is sad, however, that my poor lord died during this attack. I feel more sorry for the less. If you are, uh, if you are good friends, I trust you will keep her occupied before the funeral. Oh yeah, that's the funeral. That's Nalia's uh, personal quest. Has a funeral of her father inside uh, of the storyline of that quest. Have you ever heard of a wizard named Ironicus? I doubt. No, magic users aren't to be trusted. I don't know any Mistress Nalia dabbled in those out myself. I don't know why Mistress Nalia dabbled, okay. Uh, do you know anything about cold wizards? What's 
snake. Cold, okay. Uh, then you're unlikely to find this uh, friend. I have a friend who began being held, okay? The wizard don't give anything up, and nobody knows where to find them, except those who don't talk. But that's unlikely to deter you, I. I'm sorry, I don't really know anything about... Oh, you're a big, big help, aren't you? Okay, Nalia. How can I help? Uh, you. True. You've done it? They're all dead? What if... What if my father? Is he well? Oh. You know, yes, I did kill them. That's what... That was the deed, wasn't it? That... Sorry about your luck. I'm sorry. No, I was not able to save him. Okay, let's be polite. She's a noble. Dead he is. And you see, we get experience. Two party members. I'm sorry, I must take a moment to collect myself. You have been most kind. Please, let me pay you what I can and then... Then... Oh no, I don't suppose I could convince you to remain here for a while. I really need... No, no. It is my own problem. I'll deal with it as best I can. Let's see. Say your peace, Nalia. I'm not loose sleep wondering what you might have said, or there's no harm in asking, whatever it is. She paid me 650 gold pieces. <laughs> not that big of a amount, considering I have more than 50,000. Uh, say your peace, Nalia. Yeah. It's a very awkward situation, and I'm not quite sure if I'm ready to deal with it. I don't have much choice, though. Now that father is gone, I am betrothed, you see. Yes, some powerful associates of my father roped me into that tired custom. I'm to wed a brat of a man named Issa Roedal. That name doesn't sound good. I think father regretted it, but that is the way wealthy families gain statues and statues, status and business. He seemed quite willing to stall the inevitable, but now he's gone. <laughs> what is required of me, then? Regrettable. What is left for you to do? Yes, it's very sad. What is <laughs> required of me? The Roanals, mainly Isai, 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 whatever the name is, have been pressuring. They know I was the only heir, and traditionally titles fall to a male. I fear Isai will take control and abuse our wealth. Can anyone tell me how you read this? Isai? Whatever. I have worked to forge a relationship with those beneath me, but it will not continue with the Rionals in power. They are snobbish, snooty, and so arrogant. Ah, not the type of person I would associate with either. What can I do? Ah, uh, that's a, more of a good line, and I'm Eve also. Oh, Nalia. Coddled in wealth. Yes, that would be horrible. What is it you want, then? <laughs> Let's go with this one. I need a way to get out of that betrothal. Betrothal. Betrothal, whatever. And I need to do it soon. They respect the old tradition, and I think I know a way to use one of our mutual... One of our mutual advantages. Advantage. One, two our mutual advantage, sorry. Speak on. What is it you are proposing to avoid the proposal? A disappearance? <laughs> no. <laughs> I just su suggested a murder. Uh, what I really wish is to take advantage of an old tradition where a fighting soul would become the lord of the manor once the current lord had passed on. You are... Versed in combat, you would be an impressive obstacle to Issei. Um, Issei, whatever. Crap, I don't know how to read this name. Issei, I think. Issei. I ask that you assume title to the keep. You will be a figurehead, and I will be a ward of sort. It is my right as heir to choose who shall lead. I do not know if I could stand before the Ronals, but you, with your... <coughs> Talents uh, would prove uh, your talents would prove a daunting figure. <laughs> to be Lord Kalin, I like the sound of that. <laughs> As well, you should. And it is a natural progression. It is not uncommon for a fighting fighting soul to take possession of a keep when the Lord is is dead. Please, 
This will ensure that the Ronalds do not take control of my home. They are oppressive nobles and will not direct this place in a way uh, that will honor my father. And of course I have the ability to refuse her, I think. Not have anything to do with this. I cannot accept. I'll take your offer and damn uh, those that stand in our way. I'll see this place run properly. Proper. Or I can say uh, it will be an honor to guide this place through its troubles. I shall strive to see its flourish. No, number two. Wonderful. Now they can't force me out. You are master of this place within reason. Uh, I remain the sole heir and can take away what has been given. Hmm. So if I'll be not a good lord, she'll probably take it away. <laughs> Shall we go? No need to wait around. Uh, though you are welcome to organize the place as you see fit, the servants will return their place in order again, I thank you. Aha! And here we are, Greetings moved. to you, Your Grace. I uh, understand from Mistress Nalia that you are to be the new proprietor of the keep and the surrounding farmlands, yes? Uh, well, yes. Of course, it's a much more understandable uh, situation if you take Nalia into your group, but mm, as I said before, she is not that good of a character. Good in the sense of character and personality, not good with stats and classes. Yes, that's right, that's me. Very well then, I am the Mayor Domo of the castle, or at least I served as such under Lord Darnis. I am certainly willing to serve you in the same capacity. I can vouch for him, Kaelin. He served my father for a long time and, well, and there's nobody else really who can do his job around here anyway. As the lady said, I suppose I run day-to-day -day operations in the keep, handing servants and any minor problems that occur with the farmers or others on your land. I also ensure that taxes are collected and kept in the coffers here. If you wish to change taxes from how they were under Odernis, just tell me. A large amount of the coin will be given or will go into rebuilding the keep the uh, deplete uh, force of men at arms and into maintaining the keep as its staff. But I estimate you will still gather say 500 gold pieces per week, that means I have another place where I can gather gold to pay to Renal. <laughs> if you wish to access that, you have but to come to me. As for the major, major decisions, well, I suggest you return at least every couple of weeks. If there is anything critical, a runner will find you if they can. There is nothing that requires immediate attention. The servants will be cleaning up and I am sure funeral arrangements have yet to be made for Lord Darnis. Have you any questions then? Hmm. Yeah, how big is the land? Well, I am sure you have seen the keep itself. You will also uh, lord over a large amount of surrounding land lands. There are no settlements per se, but there are rich farmlands. Lord Darnis always gets uh, got uh, on well with his people and did most of his forebears. It is peaceful here. Usually, you should have little problems, I would think. Uh, do -do -do. I would like to raise extra taxes. I'm in need of coin right now. Actually, I'm not, so let's keep it civil for now. Uh, let's not oppress the people. So, the keep is all mine, then. Yes, my lord, all yours, as Mistress Nadia stated. A few servants remain, and some new ones have been hired. You are free to explore as you will. Uh, <laughs> any money in the coffers right now? The tool took a lot from the keep, as far as I can tell. Well, basically, I took even more. Unless you found some of these things while you were <coughs> recovering the keep, there is nothing. But if you wait a week or so, the, crop, uh, the crops of the farmlands will start making profit. As I said, 500 gold is the average that Lord Darnese gathered. <sighs> yeah. I would like to read. Nah, that's all. And I'll be on my way. As you say, Lord Kaelin, who he names him Lord, sounds fun. I am sure you can find your bedroom if you wish to stay the night, and arrangements can be made for your friends. Lady Nali, of course, shall remain here as her old quarters. If you wish to speak to her, I am sure you will be able to find her there. And and Lady Dalcia, 
I most certainly will not stay here. You cannot expect me to spend another minute in this place with these these ruffians. Auntie, Kaelin saved our keep from being overrun by trolls, and he is helping keep our home from being taken over by the Rowanals. And of course she's not satisfied with that. They may be so, dear niece, but that does not mean he possesses any noble blood to rule this land. Hello, godchild here. <laughs> I would sooner see an acceptable noble Rowanal rule here than this, this, this impostor. Do not think you truly rule here, Kaelin. Proper noble hands will return. I consider my home to be no better off than when it was occupied by the trolls. Trolls. I'm sorry, Kaelin. It's, it's my right to do as I wish with the land, and I true trust you. She'll get over it. I'll be in my room if you need me for anything. If you need anything else of me, then, my lord, do not hesitate. I can usually be found here at the audience chamber. Now they will stay here. Consider it done. Uh, now let On me just own. see. Because I think this is a different area, in a sense. But all of these things are empty, so there's no real reason to stay here. Close the door. Thank you. What do you require? So we might I just wait your go word. out. Uh, outside, these uh, servants they can give you a little bit of a rundown of how people. Are it shall be. dealing now. You can also see the whole keep. This guy is a uh, new captain. I trust you have no hostile intentions. Uh, a shame, Captain Ard retired, my lord. He felt uh, he felt he had failed. Lord, and he somehow I am Sen 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 Sir Nick. Oh my God, Sir Nick. Sir Nick is a type of in Polish. Sir Nick is, uh, <laughs> of course, a little bit differently um, said. Sernik. <laughs> it's a type of cheesecake. And I have taken his place as the captain of the guard. Okay, cheesecake. Yes, <laughs> whatever. Done. Like I care. Ah, uh, that's more or less everything. Here. Let's just save close to a place where we can leave this whole area. And level up our main character because as you can see he got the level. Quick save. And what do we have here? Oh! <laughs> Hit points. One. Lore increased by three. This is a uh, thief level up. Okay. Uh, hide and. No, maybe not this. Let's go open locks, of course. This one has to be quite high. And finding traps. And these five. Let's put them in hide and shadows, because I do hide in shadows sometimes. Unfortunately, not much will change. Oh, the hero has a level too. Cool. That's the thing with dual class characters, multi class characters, because they level up quite a lot. Ah, priest spells. Cool. So let's already put those into use. Actually, those. Uh, they aren't really that helpful anymore. I mean, the cure light wounds. This might be a good one. Protection from fire, especially when you fight dragons. And there is some dragons coming up later. Heal. That's quite obviously a good spell. What is my task? Now, I have to think what to do next. Hmm. <laughs> Corgan mentioned one thing. He mentioned a guy in the let me just say what was the name of this district? Government district. Uh, that's a quest that uh, will give me the third and final, I think, will give me the third and final of my uh, strongholds, the mage stronghold. And it should be, it's, it's a good idea to go there. So, we can also go trade meets. Actually, I don't want to go there. First, let's go to the city gates. Will we be attacked? No, we were not attacked. This guy is who? I will do my best. Ah, this way. Okay, in a second. But first, I want to go and with using uh, the city gate, I unblocked this uh, whispering wind spear hills. Cool, cool. I will stay, of course, yes. here. Witness. A little Have a look at my wares. Well, I trust you'll find them all in merchant who is condition. attacked. Get away, you! I won't pay. 
You pay, you will, or you'll get a face full of fist. That's pretty clear, isn't it? Bully all you want, but I don't have time for it. Leave, leave me be. I ain't letting you go anywhere. And anywhere. You pay up, or I start to smash. Hmm. I think this the guy Han, Honey, whatever. <laughs> I can say fight, kill him. All this sounds to be fun to watch. Or I can play the nice guy. Thing is, if I play the nice guy, I get a shop for a moment. But well, this should be fun to watch. Who, who are you? Get lost. This doesn't matter to you, to you none. Matters if you do it wrong. Go on, kill him. Hurry up. I'm not doing a thing, and <laughs> it's amusing. So I'm going to watch. What? What? Well, okay, but you stay back. Don't want to fight you too. That's it? You're not going to help? What kind of people are you? Evil. That's the kind of... that doesn't mind me threatening you. Now hand over your gold. Alright, alright, here's your damn gold. I hope if you choke on it. Now leave me be. Ha, ah, today's a good day. Is it? Hmm. And they... disappeared. Into thin air. Now we go to the government district. So you have to see what the hell is going on here. Do, do, do. Oh, Very well. we came from this direction. Just kind of a interesting thing to see. Oh yeah, there's the gnome as well there. Be merry, oh, Mardin. Ah, it is Corgan Bloodax at last. I have watched for you and your companions for some time, but these these are not your usual comrades in arms. If you be speaking of Shagbag, then the other traitors did me. This be me new party, and a much better one at that. But enough of ya, gap man. You asked me to come. Here ya contract for Krogan on me. If you wasted me time, I'll be sorely put out. I'll warn ya now. Uh, uh, there is a contract indeed. But perhaps I should introduce myself to your new friends. Mr. Bloodax, I do not wish to give the wrong impression. Do as you wish, long legs, but do not call me Mr. Mr. Bloodax again. The name will be Corgan only. I ye can speak to Kaelin here, if you're speak to any one of us. Okay, now leaving the battle axe guy behind. I am Madin. I represent one of the masters of the Catla Order of the Cold Wizards. He, speak, he seeks to employ you in a matter of some urgency. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, what kind of reward can I looking before you speak any further? Ah, the reward for the task is known only to the one I represent, but he is eager to meet with you, and as a cold wizard possesses resources to offer great rewards. What do you wish to meet him, meet with him? And what if I say I wish to know the whereabouts of Imwen? Might your wizard seem way to doing that? I do not know anything about that. I represent one of the wizards, as I said, a master Tolgarius. Tolgarius. Perhaps you could speak to him of this Imwen. Hmm. Yeah, tell me about the task more. The matter is most sensitive. I have been given little knowledge of it. Tol Tol Tolgarius. Tol Tolgarius. The one whom I speak for is eager to meet you with uh, you and discuss those matters. <sighs> All right then. Tell me how I got about this meeting with Tolgarius. Yeah. Tell me about the meeting. You will be most pleased. Master can be found in the government building behind me. Sorry, I skipped his name. <laughs> you may go with uh, within. Do not tarry over long, my friend. I am not rolling or um, uh, at the thoughts of working for the bloody wizards, but it could be a profitable contract, and I'll nay let it fall some wet eager pretender. You should think too, Kaelin, that you cold wizards may provide you with information. More be and more and may be more pleased to do so if you're done them a task or nay. It is up to ye. I say let us go within the building and at least talk to Yon Torgeria's eye, and I'll even leave the final decision up to ye, Kaelin, to make it fair. He's making something fair. Now that's an interesting thing. This place is also... Ah, there's one more thing here. These are... I said, by the way, 
there is some estates, for example, rural estate, which we will probably visit. Oh wait, no. Will we? I don't remember. You you certainly visit if you have Nalia in your party. Temple of Hukin, that's also the prison here. Pyro Camp Estate, that's for Keldon. And some other places, Government Park and so. But there is, as you might see here, before the prison there are some interesting looking poles. One of them is usable. Now this one's important. We will need another party member here. But first, give me a moment. Give me a second, I have to do something else. So let's save ourselves a little to drow. I hope we'll be able to do it without problems. Look ye all upon this foul drow that we have bound before ye. A creature of evil and darkness, my brethren. A creature of foulness and deceit, bent only on our destruction. As you might see from the name of this guy, these guys aren't exactly good in the head. This creature has foolishly come amongst us, my brethren, thinking that we would be lax in our senses. Tell me what should be done with it. Burn it! Why every... Oh, quite... quite natural reaction from a mob. Burn! I burn the elf! Her dark and fiendish kin rose up from their underground homes and killed my father and brother! They are all evil, I tell you, all of them! Superstitions, stereotypes. Then the drow shall burn! Gather round, my brethren, and witness the will of Bashava triumph over foul evil! We'll see about you that. You are mad! I have done nothing to any of you! I seek only to make mm -hmm. my way without molestation. Why have you done this? Why? And this is Viconia, or Viconia. I mentioned in the first um, episode, she is a romance character for the evil uh, male, evil ma for the evil character, because she is evil. Uh, but she is not evil as other drows are. She has a different goddess, she is a cleric. And uh, of course, it doesn't. There's no pre. Uh, the, there is no such a pre um, requirement that you have to be evil to romance her. It's more or less that the the the, the romance is uh, designed that way. So she is sort of a. Uh, she has equivalents in Eri and Juhira. Uh I love this the, this this uh, this romance with her because it's very deep. It's complicated it's not easy to do uh, if you want to try it for first uh, that is also why I think uh, I, I won't feature that in the LP because uh, I suggest play this game and witness this uh, romance yourself she is if you if I take her to report if I will take her now to the party uh, save her here and then have her in the party uh, first of all, my reputation goes down, because if you have a draw in your party, your reputation goes down by two points. She will, at some point, uh, start arguing uh, with Jahira very much. Uh, but her personality is very intriguing. Uh, equivalent in modern games would be a little bit about some... It's hard to compare, uh, but this one is my favorite in this game. Uh, my favorite, but it doesn't mean everyone's favorite, so since I decided we go with Jahira in our party, because Jahira is a little bit of a better character, I think, uh, Vicuña can be a very powerful character if you give her special tool, uh, e equipment, and so on, uh, but she would just fill in another uh, part in my group, and as I said before, I, I have a different uh, view, so for now... That is as good a reason as any! <laughs> this is a discrimination, isn't it? Ye shall be silent, evil one! The power of the maid of misrule will be demonstrated here today! Bashaba is, of course, is a chaotic character, as you might see from what he says. Demonstrated. Demonstrated, whatever. Uh, demonstrated uh, maiden of misrule. This quite clearly puts the 
goddess Bashaba in uh, the pantheon of chaotic. Mm, chaotic neutral, I think. I might be wrong. Burn her now! Everyone wants burn to burn her. her. No! Now! Olaf Blindial! She's, of course, using the drow language. She is, unlike other drows, sometimes uh, she is proud of the fact that she's a drow. But she's also proud that she's not uh, the usual drow. She, is, she came to the world, uh, to the upper world, to the surface. Uh, those of you who read some of Salvator's books and maybe uh, Forgotten Realms books might know, uh, drows live under, in Underdark. It's a big series of caves under the surface of Faerun. Spout your evil speech oh, if ye cool. must, drow, uh -huh. but prepare yourself for your journey into the next world. Beg for forgiveness, beg for salvation, and hope that the cleansing fire will save ye. You might also be a heartless bastard and don't save her. But I have no love for Drow. Nor for this Drow in particular, but it seems that she has done nothing to deserve this fate, other than simply be a Drow. This is not justice. And of course Jahira shows her compassion. It's more or less everything we can do. Now, there's three of these guys. Fanatic here, fanatic here, and a fanatic here. On my arm. Uh, I will take this guy Done. here. Be quick with it. Uh, oh, Colgan, you will a try this guy. Be yeah. This guy here, this. Edwin oh, as well. Right. And you in the meantime, Jahira, you go try fighting done. this guy. Shah, my deliverance is in your hands. Wait, I recognize you. And of course, she says, Kalin, it is I, Piconia de Vere. You must remember, my life depends on it. Please, Kaylin, I beg of you, save me from this madman. Now we will take our positions. I await your uh, can we... <laughs> no. Please, Jahira, don't do that. What do you require? Uh, since I already have on myself uh, the, uh, the plate armor, I can use this little interactive thing here and it says quite clearly you see an elven woman, a drow tied to a stake a mob of people st stands nearby, the occasional shout of burn her comes from the crowd anger and fear crosses the drow's calm what? countenance have to check what this means you could cut her down if you wish but this shall surely anger the crowd that's what we do praise the goddess my thanks for your I timely intervention Boldly, you walk up to the stake and cut down the woman free. The armed men turn their ear upon you. What are you doing? <laughs> Why have ye interfered with the judgment of Beshaba? Because I'm her evil. Her will must be shown to the people. And evil characters help each other. Allies of the foul creature. Allies of the drow. Yes, I am. This can never be allowed. The drow dies. I don't think so. <laughs> Run for it. And here we go. She starts using magic because she's no my ma no sorry not magic. She's a cleric, so she has cleric spells. In the meantime, I'll cast this here. Yes. Shira, you try to kill this guy. Can you use anything? No, I don't think so. Just attack him. The axe. Hmm. Your I'm axe is bloody nice. ready, I know. Yes. What yes, is my I see. This guy. Is... Oh fuck! I screwed up. Okay. These guys aren't exactly that difficult. I am ready. Let me think. What can you do to hero? Oh, Hogan was quick. And yeah, that's everything. He dies. I owe you my life, Abiel. You have saved me once again. I did nothing to provoke their attack, I tell you. I was passing through the city when the man guessed my identity under my hood. Hmm. Considering her hood on the portrait is very revealing. <laughs> I was surprised, and he called out to others, uh, revealing me. I suppose they assumed I was here to spy on them. Fools. They are so quick to fear. He's Reveen. Reveen is the name for basically everyone living on the surface. But. Come, we must be on our way soon if we are to avoid drawing another crowd. I disrupt these barbaric people too much to hang about. It would be both a privilege and an honor to join you, Kaelin, 
What say you to my proposal? She of course wants to join us, considering she has nothing on her. Mm, she's in the middle of a city, uh, filled with people who are quite easy to judge her on her skin. Uh, it's obvious choice that she wants to join us. Truth be known, I am not opposed to having Vaikonia travel with us. Remember, though, that many will think less of us simply because she is here. The decision ultimately is Kaelin's. Have a backbone, Kaelin. Take me with you and I will fight by your side. Together, we shall vanquish all. Actually, in the first game, you also encounter her when she's being chased by a law enforcer. Uh, flaming Fists from Baldur's Gate, the main city in the title. Uh, I saved you, Vikonia, but now you are on your own. Go, I don't wish to see you again. Let's not close that door, perhaps later. As you wish, I will be here a while yet. If you change your mind, Kaelin, I may be found amidst the artful monuments in the Grave District. Most of the city is brimming with artless rubble, who murder a drow soon as draw breath, or worse. Look for me among the dead. And... It shall be. That was her. Now let me just gather from these guys what we can from them. I will take this with me as well because it might, yes. it's a little bit of gold as well. Heavy, but gold. What the hell happened? I added that here. I think I did. What so is my gold there? They don't have anything useful, as you can quite clearly see. No, 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 don't want that. That's more than everything. Honor. I have to go and find a shop, I think. But first, let's take the quest from this place. Can't save during combat. No, it's finished. There's no combat. So let's go inside, find this Torgarius guy. And one more thing. Consider this guy here, called Corneil. Speak up, speak up! He is... A cold wizard, <clears throat> a representative of cold wizard, and he will take a bribe from us. What is it you wish? You are obviously out of place here, so unless you have pressing business, I am very busy and do not wish to be bothered by such as you. What is your purpose here? What branch of government are you with? If it is any of your concern, I am saddled, uh, I am saddled with clerical upkeep of mystical regulations. Magic is restricted in this land and. Rightfully so. Mages are dangerous devi deviants. Hmm, <laughs> talking to a mage. But I've seen plenty of mages in the city, and they don't seem to have any trouble from the cold wizards. I'm sure you're mistaken. Mages uh, you speak of are either members of the cold wizards or have proven themselves <clears throat> worthy of a license to use their magical magics here in the city. So you have to prove yourself worthy of license. Well, for one, you must make a monetary sacrifice. <laughs> a bribe. After that, we allow you to use magic in the city. Basically, Amon is filled with people uh, with corruption on every level. Mm, sound you prove to be deviant, you lose your rights. Uh, and just how much do you this monetary sacrifice is exactly? 5,000 five thousand gold pieces, no less, and should you prove unworthy of the right to use magic and arm, your coin is not returned. Hmm. Fine then, here you go. I have enough money to afford this. And it might be useful to have the possibility to use magic in the district. Uh, it's costly, but... Uh, yeah, you know, as you saw with the harpers, we had some problem there. Uh, I had to use the spells indoors and then go outside, that, 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 another. and I can't use offensive spells on my enemies. You and your companions will have the right for now to cast magic within the city. Do not abuse the privilege or you will lost it, lose it. Uh, there's also tons of other people here. Mm, not No quest givers, givers actually besides this guy. Tulgarius of course. I am one of the few who are chosen. Chosen. <laughs> really? I am one of the Ah, yes, I do chosen. see Meden has proved to be his faithful self. How are you, my dwarven mercenary? Are you up to the task Meden has recruited you for? Oh, great. Another uh, Kogan sequence. 
I be up to any task, wizard. But if there be a con convincing to be done, you'd best convince me come right here killing. It'd be his decision whether we take the job or nay. Truly. Ah, a more tem tempered attitude than I expected of you, dwarf. The advantage of serving the cold wizards should be plain for anyone to see. Ah, perhaps meeting has let slip a little of what this is about, no? Well, yes, I do have something I would like you very much to do if you care to hear it. First, I would like to know where Imoen is. Imoen? Ah, the girl listed by along with that wizard, with the wizard. I do not have such inconsequential information on me, so put aside such demands. Hmm. If I must, but you put me in a difficult position asking for commitment to a task I know nothing about. Yes, it is a lot for even uh, I to ask, eh? You are more than capable of performing this task, and it will conflict with none of your current loyalties. <laughs> if you believe any of that, I have a bridge in Anorok I'd like to sell you. Do not trust him, I say. Uh, Edwin, of course, proves to be a red wizard. And, of course, wizards basically don't work together as uh, groups of power. Red wizards are, are, are very powerful uh, group. Maybe not here in Amn, but in certain areas of the world as well. And he mentions Anorok. Anorok is a big desert north. Uh, you can visit that place in Neverwinter Nights. Expansion pack number one, sorry. And you would gargan the goodwill of the cold wizards, not to mention a substantial reward. But if you are determined to refuse, our certainly cannot stop you. I would know more of this reward before I agree. The reward. Adventurers have much use for items the cold wizards hold. It is sad that magic is so despised in Atkatla, for it has many uses. Out with it, wizard! If there be treasure to be had, I wish to know of it. We will offer you an item of substantial magical power as well as a good deed of gold coin. But again, I must have your word on the matter before I continue. Great. What he basically says is, buy a cat in uh, a sack. We have a saying like that. If you buy something and you don't know exactly what it is, you buy a cat in a sack. I don't know if there's English for that as well. Well, whatever. Of course, he wants me to agree before I know the details, which is, from a business point of view, is stupid and not very uh, wise, but I will do it anyway because I know... I know. My character doesn't know. I know what's going on. <sighs> if that is how it must be, then agree. Then I agree. You have my word. Excellent. Your agreement means that the cold wizard shall hold you to your will. This matter must be handled with discretion and exped expedience. Not to mention you want to give me the details in the middle of a government building, which is filled possibly with people who should not be hearing this conversation. There is something that has been plaguing us for more than a week now, and has become quite alarming. You know of the prevailing attitude against magic here in arm. Yes? Well, among some of it, even worse than that, a burning, palpable hatred. One particular man here in Atkatla has murdered two of our members in cold blood. He's currently in hiding and we need you to track the fellow down. We have been unable to do so much of our frustration. Cold wizards cannot be assaulted without repercussions or it will lead to... Serious problems. Who is this murderer? Then, and how am I supposed to track him down when you failed? He is Valigar Cortala, last son of a wealthy family and a true brute. Ask around and you may discover if he is hiding within the city or somewhere, someplace else. He has a home in the Dick Dock district. Or he may have fled to the Umar Hills. How is he able to pinpoint exactly Umar Hills? I don't know. His friends uh, and servants will not speak to us, but they may to you. Why should they do that? I have no idea. Ah, and just what am I supposed to do with this vulgar fellow once I find him? I am no murderer. Of course I am. Anything else I should know? 
and he gave me world map has been updated. Okay, there is nothing I can think of. Perform your promises, task, and the cold wizards shall be pleased. Ah. And once I have found that fellow, what am I to do with him? We do not ask that you commit any murder. We wish Valagar will deliver to us, that is all. He will likely resist, so if you must kill him, so be it. While surely all mur murderers must be brought to task, I wonder what manner of justice the cold wizard would apply. It is something to consider. But if you do kill him, I simply must have his body. Valigar must be delivered to us whenever he is dead or alive. You understand? Yes? <sighs> Very well then, I shall do my best to produce this murderer for you. To what the hell? To pr prosecure, procure, okay. You gave your word, so I expect nothing less. I await the sight of this murderer's body soon. A hunt for a bounty, is it? <laughs> I wonder what the wizard given us so much background. Lies all of it, I have little doubt. Perhaps if we figure out why they want this man killing, we'll have more treasure yet. And Kogan is not that stupid, as you might see him. We have a quest to do in... Of all the places, uh, that place, that's of course, uh, district, dock district. But first, uh, since I already, I'm already here, I want also, uh, on, here, here, I want to deal with specific, one specific tough thing here, noble woman, whatever. That's a little situation that will take its place here with John, Jan, whatever. Uh, no this guy is a gnome. Our stay had best be a I don't one. like him. Basically, he has a very annoying personality, and we'll see in a moment why. Uh, and I will throw him in a prison. Are you interested in purchasing a bit of merchandise, my friend? Hmm. That's an occasion, right? Why not? What merchandise do you carry, good gnome? Good gnome. Well, you've got the look of an adventurer about you. It's been one. I've been one myself. Betwixt stinks at a what? Betwixt stinks as a turned salesman that is occasionally the market get down and the formerly self-respecting poor wearers of fine veggies are first to prostitute their abilities in the form of adventuring. Uh, sorry, no, I haven't the time to speak with you at present. Yes, of course, mobile vegetables, spelling, heroism, eternal question. <laughs> alright, alright, what are you getting at? Uh, what I'm getting at, oh so friendly one, is that I items to sell, you that are especially created by your truly to aim one on the dangerous path of heroism. They're known as Jan Janssens, that's me, uh, flasher master bruiser mate. Now pay attention. You take one of the babies and chuck it at uh, average Joe Orc. Close your eyes, real tight, and whoosh! He's running around in circles, clutching at his eyeballs and screaming and yelling like Uncle Steve after three days of a turned beer bender. And I trust all is well. Old gnome says tracks. Is the name of the Amnish what? In the name of the Amnish Reventure and Taxation Board? Ah, uh, not again! That bottom-feeding, turnip-hating, scum-sucking brigand! Nothing better to do than stop an honest businessman from selling high-quality illegal flashers for a reasonable price. Here he comes. Cover for me. And I he tries. Well. Jan Janssen, gnomish citizen of Arm, you have been charged with tax evasion and the illegal sale of illegal items in an illegal manner. Hmm, someone is always using s the word illegal. Crack, old friend, you do me great wrong. I would never break the law, as my puppy always said, Enough! You're not sidetracking me with your cursed tales again. I'm smarter than you think. <coughs> Trucks God's nickel. Shut up, you! Shut up, you! Uh, latrine duty. That's better. Whatever. We've been on to you for days, Janssen. We've caught you in the very act of selling your dangerous and illegal com contraption. 
What cruel fate! Falsely accused by an old friend. I'm not your friend, Janssen. <coughs> You're not anyone's friend. <laughs> the guard is cool. Oh, that's it. Do you enjoy guarding uh, used chamber pots? Sorry, sir. I swear this job will land me in an asylum. Why might you be? You're certainly no regular customer of this, uh, felon. I'm Kalen, an adventurer. Well, Kalen, did this gnome try to sell you a legal merchandise, specifically flashers as he called them? Thing is, I would like to be me and throw Janssen in prison. So I would say number two, yes sir, he tried to sell me flashes, or I'm tr uh the other hand, I don't know what you're talking about, you're simply talking about the weather. I'm not here to answer your questions, I've done no wrong so long, so leave me be. I believe you, it is Jan Janssen that we want. By ammunition law, you must answer my question, but I will tell you now that there is 100 gold pieces reward for any information leading to the arrest of this no. Gold. Well, Kellen, did this gnome try to sell you illegal merchandise, specifically flashes as he calls them? Hmm. There's gold in this. Yes, sir, he tried to sell me flashes. Remember, oh, was I? No, I, I was neutral evil. Whatever. Ah, Jan Janssen, we have a witness. Take him into custody. As for you, Kalen, you have done a good deed and are entitled to the reward of 100 gold pieces. I didn't want your dirty money. This man does not deserve to be arrested. Actually, he does not, but whoever. Whatever. Thank you, sir. It was the least of a conscious citizen could do. Should you feel inclined to pay Janssen's fi fine, as the gnome quite obviously wants you to, you shall find the prison on the other side of the square. Fine is 800 gold pieces. Very well, good day. Kaelin, you have to break me out. I cannot stand another year in prison. The food is terrible. Come to the guardhouse and pay me fine. My fine. I will be your humble servant forever. Help me. Kaelin, you are my only hope. True enough. But I don't actually want to do this. Uh, let's go to the dock district and find the a city. Find this... Uh, no, first we have to go to a shop, sell stuff. And there's one shop I really love in this on King's Promenade. There's of course the best shop in the game. And we might try to buy something from this place as well. Come on, people, move. It would be nice if you move. By the way, I have gold on me. No. This place here. Cool. It shall be. Oh, let's see. Do I have anything that I should take off me? Yeah, shield amulet. I'll keep that for now. Things to identify. I can identify this with the scroll. Orc leather. 10 resistance to missile attacks. Actually, it's not that good. What else can we... I oh, can identify this. Uh, Warhammer plus one giant killer. Actually, there's not that many giants in these games. Not to mention it's not really that big of a deal with this. Uh, last identification goes, let's say... And this one's final scroll on the frost. Quite good damage. So we might want to keep that one. Rather give it to you, so you can use it. Any more ones we have here? I don't think so. Right, now this goes here. What do you um, quick save. Always quick save before certain Drive things happen. At your service. What you do? Yes, some items were and in we're interested in some items. Let's see. Let's sell this, because I don't actually use that. Uh, so there are better things. Darts, we can sell those. And that's 2000 for us. Corbin, yeah. By the way, I would like to sell some of those as well. That's mainly because... Mm, to do invulnerability, no, that one's good. Ice dust, we can sell this. Because they take place events. Sell that longbow plus one, this as well, to keep the human flesh because I don't actually know what to do with it. 
Uh, spears, plus one weapons. This hammer, plus one, plus four, plus... Mm, bullets, plus two, maybe not. This hammer... This arrow, because we don't have an archer. At least not, f not yet. Oh, that's a difficult thing, you know? No, let's keep arrows. Why? Because I will put them in a specific place. So let's sell those. Uh, I will keep the arrows because I will immo and will be using bows. I'm quite sure about that. And we will use her. I'll take her because I will be I will be a cold-hearted bastard if I wouldn't at least uh, do things help my family. Oh, I spoiled something. I think. <laughs> Ooh, well, it happens. All right. Now back here. Do 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 do. Uh, no, this is okay. Let's sell those. Let's keep that one. Might be useful later. No, number two. There's also two of these. Well done. Yeah, cool. Ah, selling things in the in these games is cool. Really, really cool. Because it requires a little bit of attention. Don't want to water up this as well. And nothing here. Okay. Edwin. Spells. We don't need those. These are pathetic. This one is good. Protection from normal weapons. We'll have to... Basically we have to... Oh, no, no breach. No. We have to uh, learn those spells. Spell thrust. No. Chaos. And mm -hmm, sell this one and stay with those. Okay, and any more spells here? No, let's identify those bolts and sell them with a loss. Basically, crap, I was hoping to get some more out of this. All right, now we have 60,000 gold. Now, let's see, what can I buy for that money? Well, plus two, we have plus three, so. Nope, you're not helping. Uh, Warhammer plus two. Uh, sling for you. That's something we need for Edwin because he's basically uh, he's, he doesn't have a range weapon for now. Uh, these are not good bows. 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 No. Da 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 da. No, none of these can actually help us. Uh, shield. This shield is one of the be the best shield in the game. That's for sure. It's a fortress shield plus three, cold fortress shield plus three. It's plus seven against missile weapons and plus four in general. We have to buy it for our only person who uses that, and it's worth every penny of this. Ah, <sighs> bracelets of defense plus AC three, but there are also AC two. Where are they? I'm not sure if you... they are not here. Now this is four. Crap. I would like to buy those. AC3. I think that was AC2 somewhere. These goes to... these two... these go to Kalen. Because... Yeah, right. And I don't think I can buy anything more. Because... Like, spells or such... A rod of resurrection, that would be nice. Uh, none of this actually help us. N knife's rope, no. It's a much better rope upstairs, that's cool. Now this thing, if I take this out, put this... Now, you see, with the with this, it's minus 5. My AC is minus 5. And with those, it's minus 3. Edwin, you have 6, so we can sell those. Uh, this goes here. Minus 5. Cool. These are gonna sell those. Uh, we need that mm, items for quests. Now all of these go to you. Those links. We can sell that. And arrows. We will keep those. And we will leave them in another in another place. 
Uh, you should get some of those. Actually, he doesn't have a proficiency for that, but... Uh, well, his power is not... his power is... He's a spell caster, so she's, he's slightly bit different. Uh, this weapon is basically just an excuse for me. This sword. I'll put this here, sell this as well. Actually, I never used it. Again, where was I? Uh, ah, yes, inventory screen. I want to sell those, and basically. Hmm. That's all. Yes. Let's just sell the stuff Mart's here. The finest shopping and all of favor. Quite <laughs> selection, lowest prices, and fancy do, do, illustration. Do, yeah, these. Just the goods, fair and plain. Bye bye. And most or yeah, one thing before we end this. Ah yes, these go to Edwin as well. So I'll have. I'll probably leave them in the guild. They of course stuck up our little friend here. Uh, back, back. Oh crap. This one goes here. Mm, now let me just allow a little bit of place. I'm going to do, do this too, and this too. Uh, since Edwin is a pure mage, he will quicker get some of those what is my task? important uh, spells. Now, quick save, sorry, double quick save there. Uh, let's learn this. Yeah, that's one spell. Mm, and now Edwin. One. Oh, that spell is in your book. Cool. Uh, two. And three. Cool. We, we gain some experience out of this. Three, five, five. Cool. And the main character learns level seven spell. I failed. Which means we load the game, because I don't want to fail this. Uh, these scrolls, they are expensive and rare. That's much better. Ah, it's yes, more or less it shall now. Be. Well, well, here. Oh, wait. Con One more thing. Can I buy I something from you, Day Daydre? Greetings, good customer. Yeah, 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 A pearl whatever. to you. Do, do, do. Uh, things she has are very expensive. And some of them are really worth the effort, like this Vylor's helmet, like Robe of Vecna, and I can't afford it. How is that happening? Uh, maybe later, after we deal with another quest. Just have to think about this. Yes, ah, yes I know which quest I wanted to do. Uh, the spear. We're already doing that quest because Ka Kortala, Valley of Kortala is the beginning of that quest. You might not know it yet, but we will soon or sooner or later end up with it. We go to the docks. Hopefully there will be no ambush. No Very ambush. Well. Suburb. Um, now I have to find go to my little house, my guild here. Mm, there is no money in the guild. Uh, but I have to remember this one. Uh, I need uh, hmm, doorkeeper. Let's see. Done. Let's say this one here. Uh, I will leave here this. This, this and this. Because what I don't need them ask? for now. Mm -hmm. uh, let's release the familiar. On my now let's speak with him it again. Shall be. Slap him in the head. <laughs> yeah, he's going to my pack, and now he's in a more suitable place. Uh, I will keep those acorns. Uh, is there? Ah, yes. Now Corgan. Be quick, this be paid you will for leave this. in the storage. This and this. Uh, these are important items. Mm, and more or less, that's all. Yes, that's what all. What do you require? Consider it uh, done. To here, yes. Edwin. Oh, in this right. shop here, we will leave all of those arrows because I don't need them for now. Yes. It'll be hmm? some time before we get uh, uh, 
an archer, and that's now. Now the inventory looks much more. What is my task? Uh, empty. And with the oh, uh oh, is that you? It has been some time. Ah, yes, I killed a bunch of harpers two episodes ago or something like that. And of course, they aren't going to let go. Indeed, it has been a very long time. Dermen Courtier Dale. What is the matter, Dermen? You would not have let me walk on by, would you? I know we did not always see eye to eye, but I assure you the assure you the respect. I may well have let you pass, for there is no joy in my visit to Jahira. Do you remember the lesson I taught you? Of, of course, you were the one that introduced me to the Harpers. Yes, yes, but the lessons. What what are you getting at, Dermin? I am not here to rehash our friendship, Jahira. I have been sent to kill you. Or otherwise seek your downfall, and I do not relish the duty. I see. And what power has decided that I should be killed? I serve nature and protect the good of the land through my work as a harper. Who have I offended? Who? Jahira, Jahira you travel with an killer of harpers. I do not wish to think you had any complicity in those acts, but here he is, and he is still alive. I have washed my hands of the innocent uh, incident in the harper's hold. Galvaray was in the wrong and brought his fate upon himself. We know nothing of this. There is only the fact that you, you and your friends were the cause of many deaths. This cannot be ignored. He was in the wrong, of that I am certain. Galvaray sought to imprison Kaelin for his own gain, and I took the side of right. I could do not other. It does not seem that way, Jahira. Exact and necessary justice. That is the only route to redemption for you. The other will not accept you, accept you otherwise. This is wrong, Dermon. This is not the right solution. I cannot see this ending otherwise, Jahira. You own... Uh, y your own have died. What do you intend to do about this? Jahira, do what you must. I have been the cause for too much trouble for you. Don't let this fool scare Jahira. They have no right to meddle in the as they do. Do not trust. Do not turn on me, Jahira. You will end as your fellows did. This is an unfortunate situation they have placed you in, Jahira. I trust your judgment in this. Yeah, let's go with this one. Because I want to be a friend to her. Dermon, I, Dermon, I cannot do as you ask. You are in the wrong, as was Galvaray. I was right to choose Kaelin's side, and it is your loss if you cannot see this. Consider carefully what you are saying, child. You have a duty to justice. This is not justice. This is revenge for a lie, a falsehood that none seem bothered to find the truth behind. Is this in the Harper's justice? Then I. What are you saying, Jahira? If this is the justice you represent, then I... I renounce you. I renounce... I renounce my life as a Harper. She just said that she's going to leave the Harpers as an organization. Tough choice. Jahira, you cannot mean... Think this through. It would seem I am the only one that has thought any of this through. You do not, Calvary did not, and now the Harpers... Uh, what was I? Uh, yes, we have to finish this quite quickly. Sorry for that. It would seem I am the only one that has thought any of this through. You do not. Galvary did not. And not the Harpers. Out for blood, do not. I mourn many fellows of the Harp. But they died fighting for balance and truth. Truth. Galvary did not. And this matter cheapens their loss. I will not be part of to it, party to it. So be it then, I will take your words to those that will listen. Do not expect your life to be peaceful with this choice. It shall not be peaceful, but it's clear that the course you are on. Okay. Clearer than the course you are on. Goodbye, Dermin. I was certain of this. Did not want to be a burden, Jahira. Do not concern yourself. This was the only choice open, even if I... I wish to not talk of this. This matter is behind me. 
onwards. We have much to do. True enough. Ah, Jahira took... She dropped her Harper status. Status For me, remember that. Uh, so it is quite impressive. Thank you for watching. I will probably start uh, this... A little bit of a thing... I have to make a comment about this. But that, we'll, we'll do that at the beginning of the next episode. Thank you for watching. My name is Gabriel. Feel free to comment the video as always. Ciao!